before I start working on a house I need to convert those uh, materials if I go to the demo scene you will see that all the materials are pink and we need to do the same what we did uh, with third person cover controller is to convert those materials yeah everything pink so let's move to our house and do edit render pipeline upgrade upgrade project materials to high definition materials proceed Okay, materials converted, not all of them, but we don't need all of them. Uh, the developer had some probably unique materials for the trees, but uh, we're gonna use only the house. So I'm gonna select exterior and interior and I'm gonna copy it and go back to our scene. Okay, house copied. Let's move him. There are some decals that have uh, uh, materials that were not converted, so I think I'm gonna disable them for now. Maybe we will re enable them later. Okay, let's select decals. Just gonna disable. Also, there are some missing materials here. Let's try to change them manually. school this window let's change to Okay. 
let's try to play inside the school and uh, we will see if it's working or not maybe we need to, to make uh, wider spaces so I'm gonna drag my character to that school open the door okay let's try to go inside In the corridor is like I don't know a cage be fun to play inside the school so maybe I'll just create a, a smaller house nearby and we will keep this school and we can prototype inside it when we create our AIs so I think it's gonna be really nice to play inside that school there's another door let's try to get inside To get inside the gym, so it's probably not these doors. Maybe let's try to open those doors. Actually, we can go through. Yeah, I try to get to this area. Okay, so this area is blocked by those so let's disable them hey looks nice we could have a boss fight inside this big hall okay so in the next video I'll teach you how to build a smaller school and if you like those tutorials subscribe to our channel thank you